நாராயணம் நமஸ்கிருத்தி நரஞ்சீவ நரோத்தமம் தேவீம் சரஸ்வதீம் வாச்சம் ததோ ஜெய முதீரே ஜதம் தே புண்டரீகாட்சா நமஸ்தே விஸ்வபாவன நமஸ்தேஸ்து ஹிருஷிகேஷ மகாபுருஷ பூர்வஜ சதக்ஷரம் பிரம்ம ஏ ஈஸ்வர புமான் குணோர்மி சிருஷ்டி ஸ்திதி கால சல்லய பிரதான புத்தியாதி ஜகத் பிரபஞ்சசூ சனோஸ்து விஷ்ணுர் மதி பூதி முக்தி தக காலாத்மகோ யோசோ சச்சாம்சா கதிதோ ஹரேஹே ச பாதயதி அகம் கோரம் அல்பம் அல்பாசாரவத் அதர்மபீஜம் உத்தூதம் தமோலோப சமுவம் பிரஜாசு தாசு மைத்ரேய ராகாதிகம் அசாதகம் ததசா சஹஜாசி தேஷாம் நாதீபஜாயே ரசோல்லாசாதய சித்தய அஷ்டோ யாக Uh, Parashara is describing to Maitreya about the uh, uh, nature of people and uh, uh, how, they, how they behaved in, uh, during Krita Yuga and then how it slowly deteriorated during the Treta Yuga. So, Tataha, after uh, Krita Yuga, when, it, uh, uh, when people entered into Treta Yuga, the time, Kalatmakaha Rupaha Yaha Harehe Uptaha, Harehestu uh, um, Maya Jagatapi Ekam Rupam, Uh, another rupam is kalaha and this time was the factor that pushed people into making more papa so patayati agham patayati so it makes them uh, uh, do more of adharma buddhehe bijam tu tatra udbhutam asit there was a manifestation of adharma in all of these people so hence slowly shadaraya uh, 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 the the six enemies of the people like kama krodha lobha moha madam atsaryam this slowly started creeping into people's nature so prajasu tasu ragadikam asadhakam so, asadhakam mokshasya asadhakam it was not useful for moksha but these attitudes slowly started creeping into people and whatever was natural for them before during krita yuga rasa ullasadaya we saw the six eight types of uh, siddhi which were considered to be very natural sahaja sahaja siddhi uh, that is they could sleep wherever they want they did not feel the need for anything else because dharma buddhis tu sada aasid iti karanat tesham tu manasi they they had no need for anything else they did not want to protect anything there from whom only if there was an enemy to protect from they had to protect themselves from something and you know confine themselves to a house or build more things to kind of protect themselves there, there was no need for any of those things so there was they they had no need for food the body could automatically uh, provide that nourishment in them we probably know very little bit of what existed in krita yuga think about it millions of years ago this was not today so the 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 uh, body uh, makeup was very different then so they were able to create nourishment for themselves inside the body it will be really nice to have such siddhis today right so rasa ullasadaya cha anya siddhaya ashto bhavanti ya we have to start from the 17th tasu kshinasu asheshasu vardhamane cha patake ீரேட்டிங்ீணாசு சத்சு when they were slowly coming down in people patake vardhamane it's a balance see it's like the seesaw as your uh, uh, good things go, go down siddhi goes down the adharma buddhi and patakam goes up here in this seesaw of the, the you know even in the chinese philosophy you have this uh, uh, yin and yang right so it's the opposite of each other so when one Uh, uh, goes down the other increases to maintain the balance in the world so tasu kshinasu ityutte tatra siddhishu kshinasu satsu when all of those rasa ullasadaya sahajaha siddhayaha ye asan krita yuga jananam krit uh, uh, sharire all of those siddhi slowly started coming down and patake vardhamane when papam started increasing immediately people felt dukkham so How, what was that dukkham related to dvandva abhibhava dukkha artaha prajaha tataha bhavanti tataha because of that 
पातके वर्धमाने पातक वर्धनात सिद्धि क्षीणात च ततः प्रजा द पीपल बिकम आर्ता दे सफर बिकॉज ऑफ द दुखम ग्रीफ दट दे एक्सपीरियंस बीइंग अटैक्ट अभिभव बीइंग अटैक्ट बै द्वंद्व ड्यूअलिटी ऑफ नेचर द ड्यूअलिटी इज सुख दुखम लाभा लाभ जया जय दीस आर द टू थिंग्स दट स्टार्ट प्लेइंग अ मेजर रोल इन पीपल नो वेन दे आर असोल्टेड बै दीज ड्यूअलिटी इट सी दे दे लुक एट एन अदर पर्सन एंड सी ओके वन इज सीम्स टू बी सुख one another person seems to have too much of greed now what do i do because he has this you start connecting certain things because he has this item he is happy i also should get that item so then because i don't have that item i dukkhito aham dukkita dukkha karanat artha suffering so i am uh, unhappy and then it moves on to suffering so dwandvasya abhibavah bhavati तदनंतर अभिभव दुखिता दुखा आर्ता पीड़िता जायंते सो ई एम सैड इज वन थिंग द नेक्स्ट फीलिंग इज बीइंग टॉर्मेंटेड बाय दीज थिंग्स यू कैन नॉट स्टैंड दैट यू आर सो कॉट अप विद योर ओन सफरिंग दैट यू फेल टू रेकग्नाइज सर्टन अदर इंडिकेशन विच आर प्रॉबली देर फॉर देम टू फील हैप्पी एंड यू नॉट टू फील हैप्पी so that differentiation slowly comes down in people so people become uh, uh, tortured by the suffering uh, that happens because of the dwandvam dual nature that is there in the world and that is also kalakritam eva tad dwandva abhibavah cha kalakritah tato durgaani now they feel the need to protect themselves and start hoarding things to give them more happiness right tato durgaani tas chakruhu वार्षम पार्वत औदक कृत्रिम चथा दुर्गम परम खर्वटकादिकम दे स्टार्टेड मेकिंग फोर्ट्स विच विल प्रोटेक्ट देम फ्रॉम दीज द्वंद्व अभिभव ऐदर शीतोष्णादिक शरीर अल और इट इज इट कुड बी बिकॉज ऑफ सीइंग पीपल हू आर एक्सपीरियंसिंग दीज ड्यूअलिटीज इन नेचर विच इज सुख दुखादिक सो ई बिल्ड अ फोर्ट i then uh, hold a lot of wealth maybe grains whatever i want then i will feel much better and happier than the other person that sort of an attitude slowly started creeping into people during treta yuga so tataha after that te taha taha prajaha durgaani chakruhu they made uh, durgaani forts they they created forts to protect their uh, belongings what were these forts so varksham parvatam audakam kritrimam durgam kharvatakadikam cha puram iti durgaani chakruhu add an iti there so varksham is vrikshanam samuha they could confine themselves inside the uh, uh, forest where there are a lot of trees and that will be like a fort for them so vrikshatmakam durgam the next one is parvatam parvatanam samuha they can have a, inside the valley which is surrounded by a lot of mountains they will have their city or they will settle down inside valleys which is the, the, so the mountains acts as a act as a no, natural uh, fort for them and create that protective sphere audakam udakam maybe there is a river that the other people cannot cross so they will try to cross that river really well and then create use that river as a, a fort for them the next is kritrimam durgam kritrimam is man made they create uh, forts that that is what we find today not the natural forts but those that have been created man made forts which is kritrimam which has parikhadi avritam parikha is like a moat a canal of water that is surrounds or it can be a, 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 a ditch that is very deep and steep which you cannot cross to get inside the fort that is parikha hmm? karvatakam puram karvatakadikam puram is where you have you make cities or communities which uh, are near a river or giri tatam or at the foothills of a mountain where there is a chance of moving either along the river to another place or going up into the forest for hiding 
these became places for settlement and as a community they could work towards protecting everybody else you know as a community so this concept of fort was mainly to protect themselves and their belongings and they started forming communities based on that this started happening only in treta yuga so tataha durganitaha chakruh varksham parvatam audakam kritrimam cha tataha durgam puram kharvatakadikam गृहाणि च यथान्याय तेषु चक्रु पुरादिषु शीत आतपादिबाधा प्रशमाय महामुने हे महामुने मैत्रेय शीत आतपादिबाधा प्रशमाय टू कंट्रोल द बाधा द डिफिकल्टीज और द टॉर्चर दट दे विल एक्सपीरियंस बिकॉज ऑफ शीतम और आतप दि एक्सट्रीमिटीज ऑफ टेम्परेचर शीतोष्ण Atapa is uh, sunlight, sun's heat, and shitham is cold. Uh, other things also, wind, uh, maybe rains. These are also the different types of badha uh, calamities that could affect people. In order to reduce the effect of these natural disasters, shita atapa adi badha na prashamaya for the reduction of those. Teshu uh, pura um, dishu. Ah, oh, sorry. तेषु पुरा दिशु इज फ्रम दि अर्लियर श्लोक वेर दि मेड दुर्गा चक्रु तदन त्र गिरी नदी आश्रय पुरम अभी चक्रु सो दे आलो मेड सिटी कम्युनिटी विच वर् नियर रिवर्स एंड मौंट सो तेषु पुरा दिशु इन दोज सिटी दे बिल्ट Grihani, yathanyaayam grihani chakrahu. For what? To, in order to reduce the effect of uh, natural uh, climatic changes. So yathanyaayam ityupte arthani mittaadi anusare na yatha vastu shastra. Following according to whatever they could uh, um, their budget. Whatever their budget would give, how much ever mortgage they could take, that is the arthani mitta. For the sake of artham also, and to budget their uh, uh, income and expenditure, they yathan nyayam. Whatever would fit. See, even here, because this is treta yugam, they did not go beyond their means. Yeah, Tamil or part of whatever yet na sela u patta naam po. Your income is eight, but you spend ten. so that is not the uh, method that they followed whereas in treta yuga it was still yathanyayam artha nimittadi anusarena whatever was their budget they did it within that uh, uh, sphere within their capabilities and it was also to earn more money and protect it within that house it uh, followed the vastu shastram and the houses that were built were in accordance to vastu shastram today we can't think of vastu shastram at all it's uh, you know my teacher would say people trying to look at vastu shastram after the house is built is just stupidity because one is they will allot you a plot which has no proper south east west facing you are going by what the town planning is doing so how can many of the principles of the vastu shastram will never apply today in today's world you can apply certain aspects that's all not everything can be applied in today's world so, so in those days yathanyayam grihani chakruhu they built houses according to shastras pratikaram idam kritva shita dehe ta prajaha punaha vartopayam tataha chakruhu hasta siddhim cha karmajam shita dehe pratikaram idam pratikaram kritva taha prajaha Punah. After making these pratikaram, pratikaram is usually uh, a retaliation, okay, or a solution. You can take this as a solution here. Shita dehe pratikaram, a solution for these natural temperature changes that we experience. For that, they did a solution, which is the houses. So, building of houses was mainly in order to protect the people inside from the outside nature. ओके सो शीतादेहे प्रतीकारम इदम कृत्वा आफ्टर मेकिंग दिस सॉल्यूशन फॉर शीतम कोल्ड एंड हीट एक्सट्रीम कोल्ड एंड हीट एक्सेट्रा प्रजा हताह प्रजा हा पुनः अगेन दोस सब्जेक्ट्स हु वेर इन द त्रेता युगम व्हाट दे डिड वाज वार्ता उपायम हस्तसिद्धिम कर्मजाम वार्ता हस्तसिद्धिम च चक्रुहु 
they they started doing things like agriculture which is vartha upayam vartha is jeevika vartakam bo tamil la adhaadu life or jeevanam business is also called vartakam in tamil vartha here also means business but uh, the the main purpose of business was jeevika so the word probably vartha started off as something to indicate jeevika survival and then slowly it moved on and the there is a meaning transition for words right over the years so it could have slowly come to mean uh, business in later years so vartopayam sam upayam sam solution for jeevika survival which is agriculture vartopayam tataha chakruh after building houses they started thinking of uh doing something for their living which is uh, krishi krishyadi and karmajam hastasiddhim cha chakruhu they also thought of various methods which were skill based karmajam skill based hastasiddhi which can be created with their hands and which involved work karmajam uh, that which was born out of karma by doing work physical work and that which could be created with the hand so hastabhyam siddhim uh, sadhyam bhuti bhuti ityukte aishwaryam so any wealth that could be acquired or that could be increased because of your hand skills that was also started by those people adre idu periya history lesson la irukku ah now uh, he mentions krishi in the uh, this shloka so vartha upayam here is krishyadi once you go to agriculture what are all the products of that agriculture krishyadi phalam kim ityeva it is given in the next few shlokas so these are a list of uh, uh, grains and uh, dhanyam i have tried to pick out as much as possible and uh, there could be some differences also let's see vrihayaha cha yavaschaiva godhuma anavastilaha priyangavo hi udarascha koradushaha sachina shi sachikanaha vrihayaha grains in general uh, uh, grains or it could also mean regular cultivated rice is also vrihi yava is barley godhumaha wheat anavaha anuhu anuhu is uh, millet uh tilaha sesame seeds priyangavaha uh, priyangu is also a type of millet tamil tenen solu tinai adu priyangu udaraha uh, udara is jowar um cholam namakku and then koradushaha koradushangaradu vande uh, uh, varagu kodo millet all the types of millets that you see today fox tail barnyard everything will come here now so udaraha is uh, jowar koradushaha is your kodo millet which is varag in tamil uh, sachina sachikanaha are very small peas peas can be of two types one are those huge peas uh, the other is very small ones sachikanaha are the smaller ones masha mudgaha masurascha nishpavaha sakulattakaha adhakyaha chanakaschaiva shanaha saptadasha smritaha so now totally we should have 17 here mashaha uraddal ulund mudgaha payar payarena mudga moong moong masur dal masuraha nishpavaha are your bigger peas patani sakulattakaha kulatha is id kollu horse gram adhaki is ardhaki in mustard ha mustard chanaka is chana shanaha is flax seed no we think it's something new that has come about it's all a revival of the old thing so these are 17 items uh, you can count and check if there are 17 items shana chanaka ardhaki kulatha nishpava masura mudga masham eight yeah um ardhaki is toordal no ardhaki is uh, mustard than rai what is rai hindi rai is uh, mustard that's what is given here uh it adukapram uh vrihi yava godhuma anu 
தில பிரியங்கு உதார கோரதூஷ சச்சீனக நைன் பிளஸ் எயிட் செவன்டீன் ஓகே சோ சப்தசு ஸ்மிருத்தாஷீனாம் தூ கிராமியாணம் ஜாத்தையோ முனே ஓஷதியாஸ்ய அரண்யாச்சுர்தச லீவ் அவுட் திஸ் கிராமிய அரண்யாச்சுர்தசரேட்லோக்கேட்லைன்ஸ்லைன்ஸ்லைன் கிராமியாணம் ஓஷதீனம் ஜாத்தய ஹே முனே ஹே முனே மைத்ரேய பூர்வோக்தா சப்தச கிராமியாணம் ஓஷதீனம் ஜாத்தய தீஸ் ஆர் த வில்லேஜ் வெரைட்டிஸ் விச் ஆர் த லோக்கல் வெரைட்டிஸ் வி சே டுடே ரைட் சோ த லோக்கல் வெரைட்டிஸ் ஆஃப் ஓஷதி ஓஷதி இஸ் நாட் ஓன்லி ஹர்ப்ஸ் போத் ஹர்ப்ஸ் அண்ட் கிரீன்ஸ் தட் வி யூஸ் இன் ஃபுட் Now the next set that he is going to talk about are 14. There will be a repetition from the earlier one also. But the, the next 14 are very specifically used for Yajna. Oshadhyah, Yajniyah, Gramya, Aranyah, Chaturdasha, Oshadhyah, Santi. There are 14 varieties of uh, both wild and uh, domestic Oshadhi um, plants. which are yagniyah yagnya uh, sambaddhah that which are useful for yagnya sacrifices those are vrihayah sayavah mashah godhumah anavah tilah these we have seen earlier vrihi again is cultivated rice sayava barley uh, masha is uh, ulund urad dal wheat and then anu again is millet tila is sesame priyangu saptamah so there are six here the seventh is priyangu which is uh, tenai tenama tenamavu pannu but uh, tenaiye solradu idu uh, ashtamaha the eighth one is kulathaka um, kulathaka is enna du sonne ah kull <laughs> i don't remember half of it i have to keep referring to my notes <laughs> Uh, these are eight and then we have uh, a few more here six shyamakaha nivaraha jartilaha sagavedhukaha venu yavaha markatakaha these are the next six that he is saying so shyamakastu atha nira nivaraha shyamaka is uh, is the barnyard millet i told you all the varieties of millet are going to come right shyamakaha idu vandu tamil la sama ஜர்த்திலைட்டி i don't know what it is in english or anything but idu vandu netpolam illana kaattu kundumani ingra the regular kundumani that we see is actually poisonous kundumani is enna um, gunja bhusha phanindra kitavesha nu to this is a statement this is a adjective for uh, amba in um, mooka panchashati so gunja is one type of red uh, gem a uh, red seed that we find in the cities we were never allowed to eat that this they would say it is poisonous so i am not sure what uh, type of thing they have said here venu yavaha venu is bamboo so bamboo seeds are venu yavaha tadvat markataka uh, proktah markataka can mean maize makka the makka cholam gramalyo adu vandu markataka or maize So, Shyamakaha tu atha nivaraha jartilaha sa gavedukaha tatha venu yavaha proktaha tadvatu markataka mune. These are the 14 which are gramyam and aranyam, both uh, cultivated and wild. Gramya aranyaha smritaha hi etaha oshadhyaha tu chaturdasha yagnya nishpattaye yagnyaha tatha asam hetuhu uttamaha. Etaha, Oshadhyaha, these uh, plants are 
फोर्टीन एन नंबर चतुर्दश ग्राम्य अरण्याषदय बोथ कलटिवेटेड इन वैलड प्लांट फोर्टीन ऑफ दीज प्लांट आर् यज्ञ निष्पत्त स्मृता दीज आर् मेनली एन्यूमरेटेड फॉर याग पर्पस यज्ञ निष्पत्त इन आर्डर टू इन आर्डर फॉर द यागम टू हापन यज्ञ संभव for the yagam to happen we need these 14 types of uh, uh, plants yagnyaha cha tasam um, oh wild godhuma is gavedhu ha ah, okay hmm that makes more sense because actually that is made that makes really a lot of sense when you say that so gavedhu ka if it is uh, wild one then nivara is again wild rice wild sesame and wild uh, wheat it fits uh, beautifully okay uh, yag uh, yagya nishpattaye etaha gramyaha aranyaha oshadayah cha chaturdasha smritaha for the sake of yagna to happen these are the 14 different cultivated and wild uh, grains that are said tatha in the same manner asam hetuhu yag uttamaha yagnyah eva asam uttamaha hetuhu yagnyah eva even though when we cultivate all these things we use it for our consumption but at the same time the final purpose uttamaha hetu shreshta hetu is when all of these grains are being used for a yagna so the yagna becomes yagam becomes the primary hetu for all of these grains to be cultivated and the final purpose of these grains is also to be used in a sacrifice so that it, there is a greater purpose to our cultivation more than just to fill our stomachs gramya aranyaha smrita heta oshadyastu chaturdasha yagna nishpatye ha namaste you have a doubt okay etascha saha yagnena prajanam karanam param par aparavidaha pragnyaha tato yagnyan vitanvate etascha etaha प्रजा सॉरी सह अलोंग विद दि यागम प्रजा परम कारण एंड परापर विद प्राज्ञ तत यज्ञते टू सेंटेन्स इन द श्लोक सो यज्ञन सह अलोंग विद साक्रिफस अलोंग विद यागस दीज ओषधि बिकम द परम कारण हेव बिकम द परम कारण फॉर प्रजा सी हाउ द ट्रांसिशन हेज बीन ब्यूटिफुली एक्सप्लेन इन दिस पुराण फ्रॉम द कृत युगम टू त्रेता युगम वेन दे वर् पीपल हू जस्ट हेड नरिश्मेंट इन देर ओन बॉडी रसम वॉज प्रेसेंट आलरेडी इन देर बॉडी रस उल्लासाद अष्ट सिद्धय आसन नव स्लोली दे स्टार्टेड कलटिवेटिंग थिंग्स एंड गेटिंग ग्रेन अक्यूमुलेटिंग थिंग्स फॉर सर्वैवल प्रजा परम कारण अभूत इट बिकेम एन अग्रिकलचर प्रधान अग्रिकलचर बिकेम द प्रधान फॉर प्रजा बट येट देर इज दिसक्रिफस और यागम विच आलो हेड अ प्रॉमिन एंड फॉर कंडक्टिंग दट यागम देर स्टार्ट कलटिवेटिंग दीज थिंग्स Okay, it's still a step below from how the people were in Krita Yoga. Para para vidha pragnya ha para apara vidha. The para apara vidha ka there was a mention in uh, the Swidhariyam where he says yagnya ha karanam praja ha tu karyam iti evam vidha eva para para vidha. So param is uh, param. च अपरम च ये विदंति ते एव परापर विदः दोस हु अंडरस्टैंड व्हाट इज द प्राइमरी थिंग एंड व्हाट इज द अवरम अवरम व्हिच इज सेकेंडरी सो द प्राइमरी थिंग इज यज्ञ यज्ञः एव परम इति ये जानन्ति तदनन्तरम अपरम किम इत्युक्ते प्रजाः प्रजा सो व्हेन यू डू यागम यागात यागात भवति पर्जन्यः आई डिड द सेम श्लोक इन शिवलीला अर्णवम जस्ट नाउ सो अन्नाद्भवति भूतानि पर्जन्यो भवति पर्जन्यात् अन्नम् भवति यज्ञात् भवति पर्जन्यः एंड देन यज्ञः कर्मसमुद्भवः सो यू डू एन एक्शन 
and then you perform yagam from the yagam there is uh, rains parjanyam from the parjanyam annam again and this from this annam prajaha eva karyam bhavati so that is the aparam karya the second primary reason is to perform yagas the secondary reason is for the survival of the prajaha so para apara vidaha yetu jananti yad yagnya eva karanam karanam prajascha karyam iti ye jananti te pragnyaha yagnyana vitanvante they are the people who uh, uh, start doing yagas yagnyana vitanvante okay etascha saha yagnyena um, prajanam karanam param para apara vidaha pragnya tato yagnyan vitanvate okay any questions okay we'll stop this